All right, guys, we are back with super episodes of Ape Escape 2. And good news, guys, I figured out how to use the banana ring. In between episodes, yeah, that was the thing. I went and did the gadget trainer for it and just kind of figured out what I was messing up on. And unbeknownst to what I thought, I would not have figured that out. <laughs> like, there's actually a second part to it, which I'm actually about to show you guys on this thing. So there's one in those little things. It is specifically for those ones that are in those buildings. There is, like, other uses for it, too, though. I was just a moron. Like, there's not much else to say but that. Ah, crap. I messed up. It's kind of neat, I guess. If I wasn't aiming to get all the monkeys, I probably would have tried to go without it. Alright, so this is how you use it. You throw it out here. And then he hops out. That's literally all there is to it. So it's kind of neat. I mean... Like I said, if I wasn't aiming to get all the monkeys, I probably wouldn't have done it. I mean... I love the Ape Escape game, so of course I'm not aiming to get all the monkeys. Even though this, the controls for this one are a little bit weird, I still like it too, I would say. Is that the one that I got? I think it is. Yeah, so let's get from around here. Okay, so these look like they come out somehow. Maybe I'm wrong. Yeah. But that might be after I go down there, so we'll do that first real quick. Alright. Cookie! Just like Grandma used to make. Nah, but I am kind of happy that I learned how to use the banana ring. Oh my gosh, dude. Can you just throw me a bone and let me through that? I got smashed by gate. That was like the stupidest thing that could have happened to me. enjoying playing this game though. Not gonna lie, it's been fun. It's been a nice experience. Looking forward to finishing it. Because I don't know if I ever told you guys this, like, or talked about it at all, but Ape Escape was actually a game um, I really liked as a kid. I loved the first one. And I always wanted to play the second one, but I actually never had a PS2. I actually didn't have a PS3 until I got my first job, and I could buy it for myself. But by that time, the PS4 was already out, or it was about to be out. I can't remember if it was already out or if it was about to be out, like, because the PS4 really didn't have a good lineup of games at launch. It didn't have a bad one, but they're just it still was the same issue that you would expect of any new system, was that, well, it did have games, like, I mean... What can you expect of a new system that just came out? They just made this stinking thing, so like... Oh, so you guys might think that I'm failing this? I'm actually not completely, because I'm getting higher each time. I think I am. Am I? Yeah, I was getting higher each time. Oh my gosh. means just need to do this, 
this, and this. I think you were actually supposed to use the uh, flying tool or the hula hoop for that, but we did it the hard way. Hard way worked too, so it's fine. Oh crap. Yeah, this is not fun. I don't even care that I got stabbed through that, like... For real. Oh! Goody. Oh, it's the same thing that I fought before. That's kinda dumb. Not really. Okay, so the best way to beat this thing was actually... That. So we are going to do just that again. Crap, I messed it up. I stopped spinning. There we go. It'll still work out, though. How did he run me over like that? I don't get it. That's fine, though. There's other ways to beat him. I probably should beat him the correct way. Alright. I completely just damage boosted that. I didn't mean to. Gosh, dude, why? I'm really beating this the worst way possible. I would not call that a win. I just literally damage boosted through the whole thing. That was horrible. I mean, it's fine, because it worked, I guess, but... Is that something to be proud of? I don't really think so. Okay, so yeah, this way. The win's a win, I guess? That was more like a cinematic boost. I don't know what you would call that. You cancel damage due to a cinematic? Okay, that was funny as crap, dude. Respect my ally by killing him. That was so funny though. I feel bad for him. Here he was. He was so confident in his skills, and then he gets backstabbed by a random pig. Oh, he didn't get backstabbed that time. I probably could have made it happen again, but yeah, fine. It was funny for one time. Cookies! Love when they hide like little treats like that. I wonder if there's anything on the other side. Cause I didn't really check. Yep, same stuff on the other side. And since I need cookies, I'm definitely gonna take it. I mean, obviously I need the gold too. The gold coins are like really important. Because I need to do the mini games to get the uh, trophies from the mini games. I'm actually more surprised I didn't walk into a uh, monkey. Seems like every room I've walked into, I can almost see a monkey. Yeah, I think you're actually supposed to use the flyer for these. It's whatever, though. As long as you succeed, it don't really matter, honestly. Okay, he is swimming in there for whatever reason. I have no idea how to get him out right now. Unless the ban banana ring's an option. Do I do this? Oh, it doesn't seem like that's the option. So how do you get him out? The flyer, maybe? Alright, 
So how do we get in there is the real question. Figure out how to get up here. Oh, here we go. I'm dumb. It's not been disconnected. I'm still playing on it, dummy. It's like a freaking aquarium. Oh my gosh, how did I miss him? Okay, I need to go up, 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 I need to go up. Alright. I'm Mermonkey. This is interesting. I actually kind of like that they did that. His name's actually Mermonkey! That's great! I love it. I don't like how complicated it was to get him out of there. Alright. Okay, let's go, dude. Can I actually fly from here to there? Probably not. Oh, yeah, I can. Sweet. I knew he was not gonna like that. Colon. I don't even know if that's how you're supposed to do it, but I did it that way anyway. I think that's a button down there too. It looks like it. So we'll go get the button down there. And another frame skip thing. I don't know why PlayStation now does that. It might be my internet, but I have really good internet, so I'm like not one even like I don't know, I don't think it's my internet. I almost feel like I should feel bad for him. Alright, Jonah. Oh, Jonah and the whale? Ha! <laughs> oh my gosh. Some of these references are like really obscure. So that's like a Bible reference, I think. That's also why I don't get a lot of these references. I'm not even gonna like try and lie and say that I do. Okay, so is there anything else up here that I should wonder about? There's coins up here. I should probably change my gadgets out and pull this out real quick. I only have three more gadgets to get in the game. I just realized that. That's actually kind of cool. Okay, there's nothing else up here. Just below us. I would have thought that would have been fall damage, though. And we're back at full cookies. Health, whatever you want to call it. Have I used the submarine before? I can't remember. I feel like I used it on the beach. It wasn't like... This is a much better opportunity to actually use it, though. Because the ship was really tight and not that fun. the other one. I didn't hit the ones I was trying to hit earlier, though. Oh. 
I could have had him, like, if I didn't do that, if I didn't have the stupid radar out. He's really doing ham on me right now. What the hell? Oh my gosh, dude. He made a fool out of me there. this at all, I do not like this at all, I do not like this at all, oh! What is that? If in my life have I seen that thing? Weird thing. There's a monkey. I gotta shoot him with a rocket. These rockets have such low range, though. Ah, crap. Nope. Oh my gosh. Got him. It is so hard to shoot with those rockets. Like, shooting a monkey. I remember when I caught the first one, I really didn't even think that the rocket would catch him. I was just shooting it for fun. Like. This area is very linear, though. I will give it that. It's kind of upsetting that the monkeys are this easy. I mean, I get that it's probably not in, not like meant to be played by someone by, like me, but I just remember the first one being so much harder. The only thing that's been hard about the second one has been the controls. Like, I remember one in the first game that was riding like a freaking dinosaur and it was so irritating to catch him. Oh my gosh, dude. I would use the hoop, but the hoop's not going to help me on this one. There, also, in the first one, there was ones where you would have to use the hoop. You would have to get, um... You would have to use the hoop to get near them and switch devices, like, instantaneously. Into the net and grab them that second. This one, like, literally all you have to do is get lucky when he's turning. Which, I mean, it is a little time-consuming, but not really... Or you can just catch him when he falls like that. That's an option too. I didn't even realize to tell. Oh, I even had like the cutscene for a second there. It was like he um, ducked and turned like in between the cutscene. That would have normally caught him. I can't believe I missed him that time. That was just a delayed reaction on my part. Like, he's really not a hard monkey, he's just... Oh my gosh. He, like, got... He got startled and turned and didn't go where I thought he was gonna go. Changing direction is the only time he gets hard. Got him. Gonzalez. Speedy Gonzalez. Ha. monkeys that were on that level. That was, seemed like kind of a big level overall. Alright, since we know how to use the banana ring, maybe I, should, maybe I should go back to the blue baboon and get the two out of there before we end this episode. 
But yeah, this episode's only been 20 minutes. We could actually go ahead and collect all the old monkeys real quick. And then in future recordings, we just, um... Oh, this level's like so sad without all the monkeys on the beach. Future levels with literally just kind of do two new levels in each one. Alright, so he's over here. Yep. Stupid house monkey. You know, I probably could actually use this thing here. Ta da! Now you can try to jump onto the move oh. the left. Press the right and press the right. No, it's just teaching me how to use stuff. I was like, oh maybe it actually teaches me how to use the other. Not quite. Alright, let's do this. Where is he? Where'd he go? I hear him behind me. Oh, there he is. I was like, why is he in the water? I saw him jump in the water. Oh my gosh, dude. Come here, you. That was a cutscene. I was a cutscene too, what the hell? Got him. Right, there's no more in this area. I can't remember where the last one even was, to be honest. Oh, he's inside the, that thing. Banana ring is kind of neat, but I still, I'm not big on it, honestly. Alright, he's up there. Yeah, this is the one I remember. I literally just could not figure out what I was doing here. I knew I had to use the banana ring, but I didn't listen on how to use the banana ring. That's all that it was. down here too. Neat. Makes me glad I came here. We all know I need more of those. I wasn't expecting them to be in my face like that. It's like I don't want to come. Got him. Last one for this level. The monkey. I don't even remember where this one was. I remember being mad because there was one left in here. Oh, 
That's like all I remember. I remember thinking I had like every right to be mad about this level because of where the monkey was. I just don't remember where the monkey was. Alright, it's that area. So he is literally just over there, that's all. Crap, I was just trying to jump. It's my fault. Choose gadgets. Do that. Oh, come on, are you kidding me? Halfway. That's so dumb. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm not doing these jumps properly. I remember sucking at this when I actually did this level, though, too. And then literally, I just do it like no problem that time. That's so aggravating. Alright, um. Do that instead of beam sword for now. I haven't really need beam, needed beam sword lately. What's that for? I did that already, buddy. Thank you, though. It would have been a big help if I didn't already know what I was doing. So thank you. Gadget. I definitely didn't do this part. I definitely hear the monkey. I don't see him. Every time I move the car, he gets mad. So he's definitely nearby. That's a, uh, that's a reference to, I don't think for what, though. Ming was like a smart master or something. But those are the levels that kind of annoy me. You can't give up now. Like, I'm, I get that there's going to be level, like, they try to make it so you have to go back to the level, but I don't like when they do it so there's only one monkey left in that level. That's kind of stupid to me. No offense to the devs, but like... I don't know, man. I would have rather had more monkeys. <laughs> At the same time, they were trying to keep it at uh, 300 monkeys, so I get it. All right. I get it. They had to have a couple levels that were a little bit... derpy compared to the others. Oh yeah, this level I actually need the beam sword again for. Nah, I can't be mad about it. They were just literally trying to make a good number to end on.
It tells me that it's over there, but I'm like pretty sure I have to go through this whole level to get it. Or there's at least one that I'm gonna have to go through the entire level to get. I swear that's gonna be it too. got up that so much quicker with the freaking flyer. Because it allows for you to just go straight through the levels. Ah, crap. Okay. This is not fun. I just don't enjoy that kind of stuff. Especially when you have, like, obstacles when you're running through. Ooh. Stresses me out, man. That's just me, though. That is just me being a whiner. Okay, I think this is about where I stopped. Am I? No, no, it was inside the building. I got through the building, and that was where the last monkey was for me. I think there was two cookies on either side, but I ain't gonna worry about those these times. This time, even though I need them. I should have grabbed the cookies. I was just lazy. Why was I lazy? Why did I manage to get a single jump on one of the stairs and then I was never able to do it again? Oh my gosh, dude. Is that a cookie up there? Is not a cookie. Oh well. I'm glad I don't have to go after that monkey again. That monkey sucked. I guess I was farther in this level than I realized. Oh wow, I actually did have to do that that way. I didn't even realize. Wow, it was required to do that that way. And I did it first try, too. Nice. That's a cookie. The reason they did that is because they have all these spikes down here. They're like, oh, the spikes are going to be hard. Which, I don't like spikes, so they're kind of right. This game hard though is you more so the controls than anything else. Did that actually hit me? It made a noise like it did, but I didn't see the animation. I'm not sure. Alright. Jeez, I went farther in this level than I realized. Oh crap, I hated this part. Like this part's not hard. I've dealt with it in other games where it's a lot harder than this. I just don't like it. It's just one of those mechanics that I would rather not have in any game. Because <laughs> it's stressful. Flying through the fan has never just been fun for me. Just in a while, there's probably some people that just like love that as a thing. Alright. This is where we ended. Which means there's probably another rock, there's probably another switch somewhere that knocks the monkey out of the fountain. I 
trying to hit him before he did that. Shame on me, right? There's another pig. Puppy. If I wasn't such a failure, I could have gotten through this level without using that. guarantee you that there's like a monkey over there. I hate that I'm doing this. Dang it! Come on now. I just hate the fire owls. They're such a pain. Like, and it's not even that they themselves are a pain. It's the fact that they, like, they have two health and they fly. Those two things together are what make them annoying. If it was either of those things alone, it wouldn't be bad. Ah, crap. Got him. And I really didn't have to fight all those owls, I just wanted to. So I, like, put myself through the torment of fighting them. Wasn't there like a cookie on either side of the, this one too, though? No, I'm just thinking of the other part. Dang it. Oh well. Yep, okay, that's the one over there. I'm gonna go ahead and grab him. And I'll come back for this one in the middle. I bet you there's like one in here too, ain't there? Nope! See, that makes me wonder what's in some of these boxes. Cause you, uh, break those open with a monkey fist. Which is the item you get for beating Spectre. Oh crap, he's a... Oh, he's one of those. That is not fun. That is not fun for me. Okay, um... He can fly over there all he wants. I'm not coming near him. So I've got no hope to fight him. Oh, do I have to come near him? I think I do. As close as I want to be to him. And he's trying to get me. Can I outrange him? Because that would be amazing if I could. Oh, I feel so bad for him for this. Not really. Because I have half a cookie, so I have to be cheap. Wow, poor guy. He did not deserve that. And I got a ton of cookies for that. Like, I just got rewarded for being cheap. Poor guy. Alright, um, now I need to figure out how to get that one out of the fountain. Which, it looks like there's... Yeah, there's two more monkeys here. That's one of them. Dave. And Ollie. Okay, so there's only one more. That's the one in the fountain. Can I shoot him out? I kind of want to blast him out if I'm going to do it that way, though. That was all I had to do. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, done. Oh. 
and Grace, or Gracie, I don't know how you say it in that one, because there's two different ways to say that. Yeah. And we are actually caught up for like the first time in I don't know how long. There is a couple monkeys we haven't caught. Like you're back at the beginning, but they were because they're inside like blocks. Mmm! I was not trying to do that. I was not trying to do that. Crap. <laughs> All right, so all I'm gonna do now, guys. Yeah, I'll cut the episode there. In between episodes, I'm gonna use up the gold coins, but it's 41 minutes, so I wouldn't want to attack that into this episode. Peace.